In this video, we will apply the Galaxy technique learned earlier onto the clock base. The resin is now cured and look how beautiful the clock looks on its own. I will take you through the colors we will be using. Passion Purple, Gold, Blue Violet, Baja Blue, Sapphire Blue, Pink and Coral. These are by Jacquard Pinata. You can also use Beyond inks and Nara inks that are easily available in India. Let's start with the purple. Using the technique learnt earlier, take a few drops on the surface. Add the gold next. followed by isopropyl alcohol. You will notice we are not surrounding the puddle with isopropyl as we are starting from an edge. Use the air pump to break the metallic gold and push around the ink. Now use only isopropyl to spread the ink further. Using isopropyl not only helps you save your inks, but it also gives a very nice effect by diluting the ink and giving a vibrancy to it. Here I'm using a very helpful tool that no one would tell you about. It's called a silicone tip brush. It helps you smoothen out the edges of the ink, especially when the spidery legs kind of form around. You can easily find this on Amazon.com or Amazon.in. Once the cycle is completed, follow it again. Follow the same method. Take ink, then gold, then few drops of isopropyl, and then use the pump to spread it around. Notice how we are spreading the ink in the same river-like pattern as the underpaint. We do that to get a depth in the artwork. Next, we take a few drops of the blue and follow the same process while blending with the purple. Add some pink next to the blue to get the colors of the nebula.
you can follow the pattern I am trying to achieve or you can let your heart decide it is your masterpiece after all. But make sure to keep the black portion visible on the sides as they give the void effect of the galaxy. Here, I am taking only a few drops of purple and diluting it with a lot of isopropyl to achieve the nebula gas effect. Then we add some gold to it and spread it around. We then take a few drops of the pink and add a little bit of coral and gold to it and spread it around using the pump. Then take some blue and add it next to it and use the isopropyl to mix it around to achieve the desired result. Next, we use our old brush technique, but this time I am using the white alcohol ink. In absence of that, you can also use the white acrylic paint. Dip it in the brush and use your index finger to spray it onto the clock base. But this time, spray it very sparingly around the black void area and where the colors meet. Now this will give you a certain depth because there are already stars on the underpainting and now when you further spray it, you will get a double effect. Our last step is to also cover the sides with some alcohol ink and the gold metallic. This gives a sense of continuity to the whole piece. 